Hey everybody, welcome back to Raw Food Muscle, and today I got a little tasty treat for the sweet tooth people. And uh, this is something that not only works for me, because y'all know I just got to have my sweetness. I'm sorry, I just got to have it. But I got something for my kids, because I'm trying to figure out ways to get my kids to eat healthy stuff, you know. And uh, unfortunately, you know, my kids aren't raw like I'd like them to be, although I'm trying to introduce things in, uh, them into things more and more. But I'm, I'm trying to be slick. I got to do it on the down low. So, you know, it's one of those things where it's got to be undercover, you know, mixed with a lot of fruits and stuff. So, today I'm going to be doing a fruit roll up, okay? Homemade fruit roll up. Now, fruit roll ups, a lot of kids like this kind of stuff, and this is good for, for anybody if you like, you know, something sweet to snack on. But fruit roll ups, you know, I don't know if all y'all know, but they have a lot of corn syrup in it. And corn syrup is not good for you at all. Alright, uh, so this is just a healthier version of doing it, and it's raw, and um, the way I do it, you don't have to use honey if you don't want to, but um, if, you, if you're getting your strawberries, it all depends on how sweet they are, if they're ripe, you know, as far as the seasoning, uh, if they're in season. I had these in the freezer, so I had them de and everything, so you're just going to have to taste it out, you might not need it at all, so what I have in here already is about three and a half cups of strawberries that was just basically de-thawed so it's got some um, some liquid in it uh, from you know the ice de-thawing or whatever so all I'm going to do now is just add a little bit of honey and like I said you know the honey is optional you can maybe you know if you're you know 100% vegan you can use a different types of uh, a sweetener like um, uh, agave or Yukon syrup, stevia. Um, you can try, just experiment with it. You know, you could use a couple of different things. All right, so I'm just going to add about that much. And like I said, this is all the taste. So, um, and also, when you're doing this, you want to uh, put it on a high speed. I just want to pulse it and just keep my finger on it. So. Um, because it's already, you know, soft, it's not going to take too much time, all right? So let's, let's get this thing rocking and rolling and see what it's like. All right. Let's give it a little peek. Mm. Oh, that smells good. Oh, the taste is yummy. Oh, you're going to have to maintain yourself, people, okay, because you don't want to drink it all before you, before you put it on and uh, put it in the dehydrator. So I should say I should maintain myself because this stuff is good. Go ahead and pour this on the tray, and you want to be kind of careful with this because you want to make sure you pour it thick enough, but not too thick, and then not too thin. And then you want to use this nice offset spatula because it, it's easier to work with. And uh, this one might be a little bit runnier. It's runnier than I prefer it to be, but it should be okay. I just want to make sure I spread this out evenly enough, but not too thin. Because what will happen is if it's too thin, then it's going to ha not have that um, that nice texture like a fruit roll up. Alright, I think that's okay. Just like that. See that? See if it starts opening like that? See, that's not good. You don't want that. So you want to try to get it as even as possible. Okay? Alright, so. I'm going to just leave that like that. I don't want to mess with it anymore. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this in a dehydrator overnight. Okay, so um, we're going to do a follow-up, let you see how it, how it looks, and uh, that way you can get an idea of what the texture is going to be like. So I'll see you guys in this product here, and I'm just going to go ahead and show you guys how it looks and how thin it is. You see that? It comes off real easy. You see how easy that comes off? Real nice. And at first I was a little concerned that it was a little bit too wet, because I usually don't have it that wet, but that came out perfect either way. Look at that. That's good. Okay, we're going to have my my kids test it. Here you go. You want some? 
You want some too? Here's something. What do you guys think? Good. Yeah? It's good? <laughs> we got the stamp of approval, y'all. <laughs> y'all need to get on some of this stuff, man. All right, uh, I highly recommend this uh, because, you know, the fruit roll ups like I told you before, has a lot of corn syrup and has a lot of other chemicals in it. So if you can do them on your own, man, it's so much healthier for the kids. And uh, I'm going to try to sneak in some, uh, some healthier stuff, some green stuff, you know, like uh, some protein powders. Uh, but I got to play with that to see how, how it comes out. So, mm. Mm. But man, that's so good. Y'all gotta check this out. Okay, y'all. That's that. That's it. And uh, try this recipe out. Let me know what you think. Um, give it out to your family, your friends, anybody else who's got a sweet tooth, okay? So I'll see y'all next time on Raw Food Muscles.